Hello, my darlings. Happy Thursday to you and welcome back to Let's Build the World. And welcome to the second part of the Ralston residence. We are here today. I might be a little bit lethargic today, my loves, because I'm a little bit poorly. I've got cold and flu captures here. I've got Vic's first defense, but I can feel a cold coming on and I'm hoping, fingers crossed, all wood being touched, filth, that it isn't what it could be. Um, I don't see how it could be that because I've not came into contact with anybody, but I'm definitely feeling a cold coming on without a doubt. And I didn't have one for the whole of 2020. So I'm hoping that it is a cold just to come and tickle tickle me a bit. So if I seem a little bit like <gasps> today, it's because I'm going to troop on through. I've had a coffee and we're going to get this build a little bit more done today. I've done a bit of work off of camera. You guys will see that in a minute. Um, but and I much prefer it how it looks now. So, yes, yeah, so without further ado, let's get into game and we're going to get building. Okay, my loves, so here we are back at the Ralston residence. So as we did last time, I changed the front of this a little bit. Obviously, I've put a fence on now, put a little tree out the front. We've also changed the garage door. One of you guys says, why don't you use the new door from Snowy Escape as the garage door? And I love that. That was such a good shout. So thank you so much to that person um, that mentioned that. There was also something else I got an idea off of you guys, and I can't remember what it was now um oh it was also to change the door out one of you guys said to use the cats and dogs door and it really really works is this cats and dogs yeah yeah and it, i was gonna go for this one here but i just prefer the other one for some reason i don't know why i like it and i think it matches in with the house a little bit better um yes so what i've done we've got all the windows on now we've got all of the corbels i always get corbels spandrels and dormers mixed up anybody else out there just me okay sims 4 problems you know um garage i put a chimney in now with a chimney breast i've also with the back of the build as well we were struggling with what we were going to do with the roof line out here i've actually changed around the layout inside to better fit this roof line and i just think this works I had to change these windows out slightly as well because these ones here were cutting into the window or the the roof line a bit too much. Um, and I didn't like it. So I've gone for these windows here. I might just like lift them up one more. Would that be weird on the inside? Let's have a little goosey go. Get myself away from my keyboard because I can hear the tippy tappers. I'm not for it. Um, yeah, that's a bit too high. That's a bit too high. So we'll keep it where it was. Um, but yeah, we're going to have like a big garden area here this is obviously going to be the well this is the home gym in there i've put all the wallpapers and kind of theme what we're going for on the inside it's going to be another light aesthetic with this build main reasons being i want it to kind of fit in with this kind of house style um so that's what i'm going to go for but i've slightly warmed up the colors by using a bit more of a warmer wood on the floor um and a few bright colors well not bright but at least a bit of color popped in and we're not necessarily going to go all light with the furniture and stuff in here but keeping that kind of look, I think. Anyway, so floor out, floor out. The floor plan has changed slightly. This is obviously still going to be the living area. We've got a nice big um, entrance hall there. This is going to be like a office slash library um, toilet there. This is now going to be the dining room. So this one here is going to be the dining room here. And this is going to be the kitchen here. Um, and then obviously with a little like utility bit in this part here. And there's access out and to the back from the dining room and the kitchen. But the big layout change has been upstairs. So upstairs, you come up into the main landing area here uh, with a toilet. And then it's got four bedrooms, um, one of them being a master suite with its own ensuite. Uh, and I'm very much for that. I really am. Um, so, yeah, I prefer this layout much more. I prefer the landing shape. I like this little like shape here with the landing very much for that timothy would be absolutely made up with it i tell you that much darlings so yeah today what we're going to do we're going to crack on and do more exterior details more landscaping out the front here and through the back garden as well i do want to get a pool out in this area i think this is a big enough lot to have a nice pool in i always forget how much i love this little area here in willow creek it's so bloody cute and i never give it the time of day anymore 
I just think it's such a lovely little area with a little community garden and stuff here. Um, I'm really into it. Really, really into it. I do want to get a little kind of like gardening moment out here as well. I would imagine Felix did just forget his name. I would imagine Felix does employ the hot gardener as well, as does everybody in this area of Willow Creek. Very busy gardener. He really is. Anyway, we're going to crack on. So I've already got a tree out here. I've got the big oak tree. I don't think I'm going to do any more trees out the front. I would love another one in the back. I really would. But it's just trying to place it right now. Um, maybe I could put one around here. Let me see this. Let me see how that would look. Uh, yeah, sort of, I think. Now we need to make sure to remember to make this kind of a child kind of friendly house that needs to have some sort of things in here i know um eva's only a toddler at the minute but yeah i'm gonna do that yeah no i do i like the oak tree there that's nice that's nice it just frames it nicely as well i'm all for it if you'll have to excuse me if you get and me like sniffing i hate when, when people do that trust me but i'm poorly sick and i need to and i know there's going to be loads of you giving me get well wishes in the comments you don't have to do that i promise you i'm gonna be all right but i appreciate the sentiment nonetheless i really do <laughs> you guys are amazing i bloody love you love reading through the comments from you every day it just it makes my day and guys we are less than a thousand subscribers away from a hundred thousand on youtube now um excuse me <laughs> i can't believe it I cannot believe it. I'm elated. I really am. So, yeah, guys, thank you so much. Thank you so much for the continued support on my channel. You're a special community. And I know I say that all the time. And I think you just need to hear that all the time, you know? I don't think um, communities get enough support from their kind of creators. So, this is me just giving you big, big, big fat thank yous, to be honest. Right, I do want to put a hedge out here, but not necessarily a massive one. I don't want it to cover the white picket fence. So maybe I could just do like a flower border moment here rather than a hedge. I could do a hedge down this side. Yeah, I think I'll do a hedge down this side. But the front of the house there, I'm going to do like a little flower border moment, I do believe. Yes. Yes, I am. We are in that lighting. Do we need to go onto that lighting? God, I always forget how awful the lighting is on these lots in Willow Creek. I mean, there's some good lighting. I like the evening lighting here like that. That's lovely. But when you come in, when you're coming into detail stuff, you you need you need a bit of bright light, darlings. You really do. Yes. Now, I think this would be like all like lawn. So I might even flatten this down. Very large there. I might just flatten this down here. Just so I can get like a border all the way up to that and then this here i'm gonna make like launch launch <laughs> i don't know why i just have to say it like that but there you go yeah i think i'll do that like with the green like stripes the gardener comes out here in his hot pants <sighs> <laughs> that's disgusting i hate that sound <laughs> you have to excuse me i'm poorly you know <laughs> it's gonna be my excuse for everything <laughs> I'm just poorly today, you know, so you've got to allow me to do this. <laughs> okay. Um, I do kind of want to gravel this in as well, just ever so slightly off the sides here. Like that. And also up to there as well, just so it solidifies the garage. The garage into the ground. Into the ground. Right, up there. Oh, yes. Oh, yes, queen. Yes, just a bit of that. Right, okay. And then we're going to go and border around this. I'll do all this off of camera because you've seen me do this so many times. It's going to get boring. You're going to hate it. Give me two seconds. Okay, so, yeah. The train paint is done. I've done what I normally do with, like, the earth. And then I kind of fade it out into that kind of trodden on grass moment. Very much here for it. Um... So I think what I'm going to start doing is just flowering up the edges out here. I'm wondering if they've got, if I could use like a flowered hedge like these. Oh, they do cover. I mean, I could do it that. Oh, 
Not sure about the red, though. I think we need to go slightly lighter with the, the colour. I mean, pink would look nice. Oh, I'm kind of for that, I tell you. Let's have a little goosey. Let's get the nice evening lighting. Oh, oh very romantic. Very romantic indeed. So I think I'm going to hedge up this area. with. I did say I wasn't going to use a hedge, but... Oh, that looks good. Yes. Absolutely. fucking -lutely. Yes, we're doing that. Oh, I'm for it. Absolutely for that, I tell you. And I'm going to do them over this side as well. And I'm going to try and make them not look too uniform. I may, like, go in with some, like, taller bushes and stuff as well, just to sort of break it up and it, make it not look too repetitive. A little bit more... Or natural, shall we say. Yes. Yeah, I do like the pink hedges there. That's cute. That's cute. And then I think what I'll do is just... I don't want to use you, though. There was a darker one of that. There it is. Yes. And then put these maybe on the corner. Again, just trying to break up that kind of repetitive-looking hedge. Just for a bit more... Je ne sais quoi, you know? When all else fails in life, just je ne sais quoi bleu. And everything will be fine towards the end. <laughs> Another tattoo-worthy quote from me. We are getting good at these quotes, aren't we, darlings? We really are. <laughs> yes, I'm going to get that one tattooed on me. When all else fails, just je ne sais quoi bleu. <laughs> yeah, I like it. I do. I do. I'm very much for that. Um, and I think I'll just do a bush down this end like this rather than doing a tall one. Again, we're trying not to make it look too repetitive. Too repetitive. Maybe could I like mix a colour up like with a white? Oh, I don't mind that. Let me see that again. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Yes, that's going to work. Absolutely. bloody loody. Is there only three here? Oh, I wish I was... Yeah, no, that's nice. Again, that breaks it up as well. Stop that repetitive nature from happening. Oh, I'm very much for that. Very much for that indeed. Now, this is where it's going to get complicated here because I'm going to need to use the tool mod, I think, to like sink the flowers down into the ground. So for the minute, I'm just going to pop a few random pieces there and then I'll go in a bit later and um, plonk them into the ground a little bit better. We'll have a few We'll have a few uh, yellow moments going on here as well, I think. The only problem with these, they always look very bowly, don't they? Do you know what? even. Bowly? They look very bally, and I'm all for a pair of balls, darling, but not when it comes to Sims 4 plants. <laughs> Another quote for you there. Another tattoo-worthy quote, you know? I'm here. I'm here. God, spilling out these quotes like Gandhi, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Oh, uh, do not ever compare yourself to Gandhi, Aiden. You are never going to be that much of a good human. <laughs> Even though I'm sure I've heard some conspiracy theories around Gandhi. I don't want this to be a debate in the comments. But, you know, you've got to question everything these days. You really do. Right. Um, What are we going for here? We want some more colours. But I do want them to be more pastels rather than... Rather than, like, brighter tones. Oh, the orange looks good there. Yeah, I'll put an orange one there. I might get rid of that pink, actually. It's not doing it for me. Um, Pop little orange ones on there. Oh, slow. Yep, absolutely full. I thought these come in colours. Oh, they do. Oh, stunning. Oh, well, we'll have a white for a start. Yes. Yeah, that's cute. That's cute. I do need, like, a moment here. Um... Maybe not you, darling. Didn't you come? I thought that came in colours as well. Colours! Oh, you're cute. Oh, you look nice here, actually. Oh, you do. Oh, I might mix you up in the front a little bit. Maybe not, because you do stand up above the ground quite a bit. I just like things to try and look a little bit natural, you know? Oh, natural and all that. Let's size one of those down and pop it just underneath there. Excuse you. Did that? Did, 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 did I size that down? I did. There we go. Ah, oh, yeah, yeah, lovely. Oh, very much for that. Um, underneath this tree, I'm going to do a little. Oh Christ! Look at those. I can't be dealing with that, love. Can't be dealing with that. Can't be having you poking through, sweetie. 
make me very fuming. What about that side? Is that side doing it as well? No. Good. Okay, and then here. Let's go into that ivy category again because there's some gorgeous floor ivy that I have been using to death lately. I love it. So I'm going to pop you just underneath the tree. I may need to sink that down slightly. I do. So I'll sink that down slightly with the tool mod. It's fine. Um, and here, I think what I'm going to do is wrap around... Excuse you. I would like to eye drop it. Thank you. I want to wrap around a bush. A little bush moment here. Like there. Um, oh, do you know what? Some hydrangeas would look great on this lot. I think I'll go for the pinky vibe. I'll go for the... Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Hang on. I can put you there. Can I move you to like there? And I'm going to move all of that down with the tool mold as well. That's better. That's better. That was what was throwing me off a little bit, that little area there. Yes. Yeah, I do like that. Yeah. I'm not so keen on this now here. I'm going to use this somewhere else, but I don't like it there. I think I need to go for another hydrangea here, but maybe in a white. And just pop it right into that corner there without it cutting it into anything too badly. Oh, that's much better, darling. Tell you that much. And you can come here. And I'm going to flop you into those places there. And then up here too. I love landscaping so much. It's one of my favourite things to do in The Sims. And I know loads of people don't like it. Um, and I'm, yeah, whatever personal preference, isn't it? But I love it. I find it so relaxing. When I was doing that terrain painting just a minute ago, I was in another world, loves. I don't know if it's because of me code meds and I'm off my tits. But I was having a lovely time. I really was. It was bloody lovely. Bleb. It's bloody lovely. <laughs> that is so Devon. I'm, I'm here for that, to be honest. Oh, Blue. You're looking very sorry for yourself. And I know it's because you want to go out. But we're not going out just yet, darling. We're not. Not until I've recorded, I'm afraid. You're going to have to hold on. Yes, we'll mix them two up. We definitely need to use one of these as well. I'm going to put it like there. And then overlap it with that darker one. Because I like that look. There we go. Size it down. Maybe twice is that too big there oh no it's not it looks nice and natural um but i will just skirt it around like so there we go yes i'm for that see it's starting to look a little bit more natural now and then here i'm going to use the same flowers as what we've used all along here and line this area with them let's size one down stunning and then we'll get another hydrangea Hydrangea. I wonder if there's somebody out there called Hydrangea. Hello, Hydrangea. <laughs> oh, if there is, I'm not laughing at your name. It's a beautiful name. <laughs> no, it is. It is. It's stunning. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I'm, just shut up, Aiden. Just, just carry on. <laughs> just carry on before you offend anyone. And they start shouting at you in the comments. How dare you? My name's Hydrangea. And I'm fuming with you now. <laughs> you need to be fuming at whoever named you Hydrangea, darling. I'm joking. God, for goodness sake. <laughs> right, dull daisies. I'm feeling a bit of a dull daisy today. I really am. <laughs> really am. I hate being poorly. Absolutely. I don't think anybody loves it. It's not like, oh, do you know what? Absolutely love feeling ill. But... I just, I really detest it. Je detest. Je deteste mon. What did that mean? I have no idea. But we're going to go with it. Um, Yeah, I hate it. Absolutely hate feeling poorly. I hope I'm feeling okay tomorrow because we've got the um, shell challenge coming tomorrow, my loves. Um, Very much looking forward to seeing what you guys do. Cannot wait. We're going to be doing like a first place and... Two runner-up places. I'm not going to do like a second or third because I don't see the point in that. I'd see, I think it'd be nice to just do two runners-up and then an overall winner. Um, and the two runners-up will get a game pack of their choice of whatever Sims 4 game pack that you want. And then the winner will get an expansion pack for whatever expansion you may need. Um, and it's a bit of a different shell challenge as well. It's not like an empty shell per se. It's more of like Design Me Devon, but for you guys... I want you guys to have, I want to give you guys a budget and a build and I want you guys to make it into your dream home. 
that's what it's basically going to be. Oh, I'm very much for it. I think you guys will be as well once it's once it's here tomorrow. All right, let's wrap you in like that. Oh, that's looking nice. Yeah, I do like that. I might pebble this up. Well, not pebble, put rocks there. Let's do that. Let me see how that would look. Um, oh, Let's get rid of all the live edit and debug rocks. Let's just get the plain rocks in, darling. Oh, I'd love to use this, but it... I don't know. I don't know. It just wasn't... It wouldn't suit it here, darling. Absolutely. Oh, I sound like Joanna Lumley. Don't you think Joanna Lumley has got the most beautiful voice? Oh, my favourite voice on the planet. Her and David Attenborough, without a doubt. If you've never heard Joanna Lumley speak, I'm sure most of you might have, then please go and Google it. Oh, honestly, it's like butter. It just sounds like butter the way she speaks. It's all breathy and lovely. <laughs> and she's one of my favourite actresses because she was in one of my favourite sitcoms of all time. Absolutely fabulous. I know I always go on about that, but it's iconic and it needs to be going on about, to be honest with you. And that is what is happening. Right, guys, I'm just going to rock all this up off of camera just so we're not wasting too much time doing this. So give me two seconds. So that was tedious. That is done. We have rocks going all the way up into the garage. And I'm very much for it. That's a big, that's gone a bit lumpy there now. Very strange. I'm not for that. Softness down and then put you right down as well, darling. Let's get that circle down. I don't know why I did that before. Very annoying. How dare you? That's supposed to be a very less better. Yeah, nice smooth drive all the way up there. Gorgeous. Um, I've also extended out the landscaping on this side as well, just to get that balance a bit nicer. Very much for that. And I think around here, I'm going to do some more bushes like we've done here, like the bigger bushes. But um, and then all along here, I'm going to do a nice hedge as well. So let's do that, shall we? So let's just use I know that's what I was going to do. I was going to train paint underneath first. That's not terrain paint. That is. Um, I used like the broken down grass and then I'll put the landscaping underneath of here. Lovely. Just like that. Just like that. And then if I can whiffle you there. Can I use the like D, just the normal size here? I don't mind if it's creeping through the fences because I can sort that out later. Um, let me see. Oh God, you're floating like nobody's business and I'm not for it. What about if I put you there? It kind of swamps. No, I'm just going to have to move this down with the tool mod. So I don't mind it floating. I will move it down and whiffle it into place once I'm uh, once I'm there. Yes. And then the lighter one. Lovely. I'm going to size you down though, darling. And flop you in the front. Just enough so I can move that down as well. Yep, yeah, that will look great. Yep. Yeah. Just to blend it in there. I've also left this side open now as well, like here. So I may even do some kind of access down from here. But I don't know. I don't know. Don't know what we're gonna do there yet, but we'll get to that in a bit. Anyway, yeah, I'm liking how that looks. Really, really liking how that looks. I think I still need to maybe add some kind of flowerage out at the front here. Like a little window box moment, but not necessarily a window box moment, like a a nice couple of plants. Um, do I want to go into the build and buy for these? Maybe. Maybe I do. Yes. I'm going to use these lavender planters and I've just balanced them around the actual bay window itself. I think that looks very pretty. I'm all for that. Don't mind it cutting in slightly because it's not going to go inside. Nope, that's fine. And then I'll do the same here as well. These are from Debug, by the way, guys. They are base game and they're lovely. I do enjoy them. More so than the actual lavender planters themselves. Have we got lavender planters? I don't think we have. But yeah, I, I just like them. I think they're stunning. I'm very much for it. Um, up here, we need a light. That is for sure. So let's get a little cheeky light up here. So this part, well, not this part, but this house is going to take a few goes. It's going to be a couple of weeks, if not going into the third week to get this one finished. Because it's a big house. Um, and I'm very much, uh, I'm very much excited to get this done. I really am. And I've also been asked by a few of you as well if I'm keeping like the pancakes, um, the land grabs. And I am. I'm going to keep them in the save file. The iconic kind of families that I like. Um, 
Uh, but I'm going to give them, like I did with the goths, I'm going to give them my own kind of makeover and stuff. I just think that would be really interesting to do. I've never done that before. So very much here for it. And I think either side here, I think I should add in like a nice, like plant, whoop, a nice thing of flowers. And don't we have those ones in the, the pots? Where are they? Let me find them. Yes, these ones. These ones here, I think, would look just really nice, like either side of the doorway here. I've sized them down as well. They were just a little bit too large. Said me, never. <laughs> I like them big. <laughs> What's that from again? I like them big. I can't remember what that's from again. But it's very funny, nonetheless. None the bloody less. And I think what I'm going to do... Oh, I thought they go... Oh, I do, do I have to place you manually? Oh... <laughs> So lazy. Come on, whiffle you up. I'm going to pop you one there. Is that floating? Oh no, that's connected. No, is it connected? No, it's slightly floating. But I think if I lift it up one more, it's going to be a bit too high. So let's try. For seals. Let me see that. Um, what? What now? Don't fuss with me. Not in the mood to be fussed. I'm poorly. <laughs> I'm poorly today and I'm not in the mood. You're fucking floating. Not in the mood to be fussed with. Very much not. It... What? You need to stop this. This instant. Right. That's connected, finally. Let me see that. Oh, I like that. I'm going to do four of them. And I'm going to do it off of camera. Oh, absolutely stunning. I'm very much for that. Oh, that looks cute. Yeah, I'm... I'm yeah, I'm definitely here for it. Look at me. Look at me being here for it. Absolutely here for it. Anyway, we're going to move on. Because I'm speaking shit and we've got lots to do. Yes, we do indeed. We've got lots to do. So I'm going to... What? Oh, goodness me. I must be off my tits from the code meds. That's all I'm putting it down to today, darlings. I love the way that I'm trying to justify the fact that I'm just weird. To be honest. <laughs> I'm just a big weirdo, but you all know that by now. We're all weird together. Absolutely here for it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that looks stunning. I, again, I'm going to try and break this up by use of different heights and stuff. Um, just to make it look a little bit more ooh, natural. Let's like cluster a few of them there. One at the edge over here or a couple at the edge over here. And then size one down there just for a little bit of a titty moment at the top there. Bloody gorgeous. Where's the big bush? You can go there. You can go there. Cluster around there. Let's turn you around. You see, that's just broke that hedge up. and made it look a little bit more natural. Oh, I'm lucky in the front of this now, loves. I tell you that much. Yeah, I'm very much here for that. Need to do some lighting and stuff, but we'll concentrate on that probably off of camera. Because I want to get a bit of the back garden done today. Um, and we've whiffled along. We've whiffled around enough with the um, landscaping already. So... Here we go. Anyway, pool. Pool moment. I want the pool to be down here, I think. Let's get the grid on so I know how wide I want it. Filth. Um <laughs> I'm gonna I'm gonna do it four wide. <laughs> Enough. Enough of your disgraceful filthiness. That's all I'm saying. Um and I'm gonna tile. Do I wanna tile around here or do I wanna use the same? I'm gonna use the same. Use the same around here. And I'm going to whiffle you all the way to there. And no, 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 not all the way to there. Because I might want a little like a bit of plantage moment going on there. So I'm going to do that to there and then connect them in like that. Yes, I like that. I do. So yeah, again, just a nice little pool moment. It's like similar sort of size really to the goth one really, isn't it? And where's the goths? Yeah, yeah, it's a similar sort of one. So they're playing Keeping Up the Joneses with the goths. <laughs> Keep up with Joneses with the goths. That's what's happening. Right. And I'm going to put a nice little trim on there like that. Maybe I could use you. What colours do you go? Oh, oh, maybe not. What about that? Oh, Christ, no. Um, No, I think I'll stick with that one, actually. Stick with that one. Change the pool colour or the water colour. Lovely. And then I'm going to go underneath with some tiles as well. Just some plain blue tiles. Uh, like these, but let's give you a good pop of that down there. Gorgeous. And then the same with the walls as well. Um, we'll use this one and I'll go dark with that as well. 
Oh, I'm full that. Yes, that's nice. So this is going to kind of be well, the pool area. I'm going to do some sun lounges here, I think. Um, here, I'm going to put a nice big parasol table so they can come out and have their dinner. Uh, along here, I might do like a little, I don't know, maybe just like a nice little like seating moment there because this is predominantly going to be where I'm going to be putting the garden a bit. I'm going to put some planters and stuff down here. I love what they've done here. I love this here. Hmm, what if I can find that? I don't really like the graphics on it, to be honest. It looks a bit janky, doesn't it? So maybe we could copy. Oh, I know what I could do. Yes, I'm going to do it now while it's in my head. Um, Go in here. Let's get rid of live edit and debug, darling. Flop out this thing of dreams here, which has come in handy throughout my home building career in The Sims. <laughs> um, And it's this beautiful little like edge moment that came with... Uh, get together. It's amazing. I love it. It's iconic. We could do something similar to this. I could like plonk it like there. Let's try and copy it, shall we? There and there. All the way along here as well, darling. I'm whiffling it around there as well. Do excuse me. Light little inside burp there. Flop you to there. Oh, still very much for that. <laughs> <laughs> I love how some of you have been trying to spell whatever when I'm whenever I say like Salim. <laughs> it's, it's the spelling for me. It really, really is. <laughs> and then we're gonna put the soil down there, even though we are putting planters on top of this. Oh, can I fit oh it probably needs to be a little bit bigger actually, filth. Um, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna overlap them. And the best thing about overlapping these is they don't glitch and it's very nice. They come in handy for borders. And in fact, I think I'm going to border the... Uh, I'm going to border the edge of the patio area as well. I am. Oh, they're a bit light. I didn't realise they were that light. Can we go darker? We can. Yes, we're going to go darker with them. They're a bit light, darlings. We don't want that. That's not the vibe we're going for. So I'm going to change all these as well. Oh, there we go. Oh, very much for that. Yeah, I like it. I'm going to stepping stone around this area, I think. And telling, seeing that now, I think we do need like a little border moment down here. So I am going to put another little bit of soil just around here. Yeah, like there. I have like a little hedge moment in that as well. Um, Yep, yeah, gorgeous. I'm all for that. Very much so. Let's get the better lighting back here. Where's the light? There we go. That's a bit better. And I'll do the same there as well. Gorgeous. Very much for it. Do I want to come down here with this? <laughs> do I want to come down here? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just weird. What more can be said? I don't like that. I don't like that at all. No, I'm not for it. Do you know what? That is not happening. I'm going to put a hedge down there. When it's out, flop a hedge out. That's what I'm saying. Right. Here, we are going to plonk another little pool moment around here. I'll do it directly in the middle. Bang. Bish, bash, bosh. Lovely. Oh, for it. Really am. And I think here, I do kind of want to separate this area off of a wall, I think. Um, a half wall. No, because I can't because of the foundation. So it needs to be a fence of some descript. Um, oh, you could work in here just like this. Yes, yes, but I think I might use the gray one. There's a gray version of this. No, I prefer the white. Yeah, I do. Just to give that area a bit more separation than what we've done with the little like bit there. Yeah, I'm for that. Okay, okay, right, okay, mm-hmm, yes. Moving on. I think we should put in some sun lounges out here. I'm going to do like a little trio moment. We wanted to start getting in some colour, so I'm going to maybe use a bit of blue. Yes, I'm going to use the blue ones. I am. Unless I want to use one of the these ones, because these come in some nice neutral tones, though. I want it to go a little bit brighter. Eh, no, we'll stick with the blue. We'll stick with that blue. That was nice. And then I'm going to do a one, a two, a one, two, three. Sorry. It's my um, years of dancing. 
أبوان تسوي أبوان تسوي تسوي با يا ذا ود جو يا يا كيو 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 Okay, um, I've got the bare bones down there at the minute. I'm going to start putting up a little table up here as well. I think I'm going to use that big... Oof, I always forget the swatches on this. It's disgusting. <laughs> I mean, that's one. that one's not too bad. But again, I really wanted a pop of colour. What, what does this one look like? Oh, this is the one with the swatches. Hmm. Um, like the gays would not have that pattern on the. They just wouldn't. The gays would not do it. They wouldn't. They would have it a bit more plain. But the swatches, though, I'm not feeling it, loves. I'm very much not. That one's not too bad. In fact, that's quite nice. Do you know what? Let's get it in the middle, though, shall we, Aiden? Oh, yes. And then it's, it's got matching. Have you... You have a matching chair. What did you come with? Perfect patio. We'll use these ones. Wrap it all around. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not too fussed on that. That's quite nice. Just a nice little moment. And it's not underneath of any, like, shelter either. So an umbrella would be lovely there. I put modern windows on the um, gym as well. I just thought it would match in quite nicely. Okay. So just so I'm going to leave you with something that looks like it's been done a little bit better, or done at least, I'm going to uh, landscape this area a little bit more, put a few more details here and there, um, and I'll show you in a minute. So I've done a little bit off of camera, just put a few hedges here. I'm going to also make this look a little bit more irregular with some taller bushes and stuff in there as well. We'll do that next time. Um, and what else have I done? Put some stepping stones in. I'm not really feeling this at the minute. I think I need to maybe put some more flowers and stuff around the tree. I definitely want to do that. But I think to finish off today, what I'm going to do is just finish this deck area up here with some more details and maybe put some more details down around the sun lounges at the bottom there as well. So what we're going to do is put in a little barbecue area. That is what is happening. Sorry if this part is going to be a little bit shorter today, but I'm feeling a little bit... Uh, I need to get cozy and just chill out this evening, I think, because I'm I'm coming down. I'm coming down with a cold. I don't know if you know <laughs> after this, <laughs> after today, but I do. I feel like I'm coming down with a cold. <laughs> um, I'm going to go for this, I think, this little moment, put a nice barbecue in this area here. I think I'm just going to use a smaller one. Rather than using the big boy. Or am I? No, in fact, I'm going to use the big boy. I'm going to use the big boy in a white. Oh, in fact, that silver's a bit more softer, actually. I prefer that. Yes. Yeah, we'll put you there. Yep, lovely. Okay. And I'm going to use a few more of these counters down the side. Did this come... No, it didn't come with a sink. I'm getting confused with this uh, kitchen and the kitchen pack from harry and felixander because they come with a sink i mean the jardin jardin sorry and it didn't come with a sink this one which is very very fuming actually i would love a matching sink with this to be honest i mean i could use this one out here oh that does look good it does i'll give it that i really will give it that there you go you can have that <laughs> yeah i think i'll use this one i'm going to tuck it in like so Oh, no, you're flopping out the edge there, dear. Let's whiffle you in slightly. Let me see this. Oh, very much for that. Yes, just a nice little barbecue area going on there. Definitely need some plants and stuff around this place. Need to load it in with a little bit more greenery. But I think there'd be more like, um, more along the lines of like flowers and stuff. I will pop a bit of green down, but I'm feeling a bit more flowers in this part i am yes we'll use you i'm gonna size you down though because you're a little bit large my love and then i'm going to whiffle you over to here as well um and pop you just there let me move you in slightly more let me see that yeah that's nice that's just popped a nice little bit of color there 
very much for that I am yes indeed and I think what I'm going to do is also ha oh god this is going to be tedious again isn't it I'm going to hang more of these up on these levels can I get the grid on here with that work no it doesn't does it no you're just a fussy tit that's what you are an absolute tit um let's pop you down one more and I'm gonna is that floating not really no I'm gonna I'm not gonna do four though because not happening that's not perfectly in the middle but it will do um life is not perfect you know You've just got to go with the irregular irregularities. Regularity? Irregularity. Irregularity. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Well, well, oh God, he's floating. Look. You little bastard. Right, let's get you up. Let's make sure that you come through. Oh, I think that might be right, actually. Yes, it is. Oh, gorgeous. Yes. And then here, I'm just going to do a nice bench and i think oh no do you know the one i love and it's this where are you this one here i love this one i love this bench i would love a bench like this and i think i'll just put one in the middle just there yes with like a table either side of it i think um uh or maybe just a nice coffee table on one side of it i could like put it along so it's not balanced that way and then put a nice coffee table next to it. Let me see that. Eh. I don't like it. No. I think it... I'm going to put a couple of flower pots next to it. The ones with the tulips in. I just had you. Where are you? Yes. There we go. And just... A, I've used like the little cart one as well. I think that looks cute. Um, we'll, And I'm going to leave it for today. And just put a few lights outside of these moments. But I do want to do some overhead lights here as well. Um, but for now, I've kind of reached my peak. <laughs> my peak of what I need to do for feeling a bit poorly. I am. So I think I'm going to go and rest up, my love. So sorry, this has probably been a bit bit crap today. But we've, we've done a bit. We've done a bit. We will get back to this. We're going to make this look absolutely stunning, this house. I really enjoy how it's looking. I really enjoy how it's coming together. Yeah, I do. I think it's cute. And we've done quite a bit today. Not too much, but... We've done a bit and that is as best or as good as I can do today because I'm very poorly. I don't know if you know, but I'm very ill. So we're going to leave it here. And yes, there we are, my loves. Thank you so much for coming today. I appreciate you. I really, really do. Blue is wanting to go out for a walkies. Oh, oh, so I need to go and do that as well. Um, You're amazing. I'll be back tomorrow with the shell challenge. Oh very excited and yes thank you so much for your support my loves get some comments down in the comment box below and i will see you tomorrow bye